Yeah. What up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Emil Kitchen. I'm back here tuned in to episode 110 of the B Side Forum right here only on bsidechat.com. Hosted by myself and my co host. What's up? What's up? There you go. What's your name for the people that don't know? What's up? I'm Ash. I'm the DJ on the show. It's okay. We're only on episode 110. We'll get it eventually. It's all good. <laughs> Did I not answer the questions correctly? What's well, Bob with you, man? Go ahead and introduce yourself. No, no, you, no, you do your thing. You do your thing. You do your thing. Let's start this way. Go ahead and introduce yourself. He I'm hates sorry to that. With the he hates it out, yeah. when people are on their phone. Okay. My apologies. My apologies. Go ahead and introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Deanna. How y'all doing? You're doing great. Hello. I'm okay. Go ahead, brother. Go ahead. Uh, you got the worst one so far. Go ahead. I'm Tony D. Mac. What's up, guys? There you go. You got the worst one. Yo, what's up, Big Bago, baby? Dedicated. Thirsty. See? No That's thing. how you do an introduction, yeah. my guy. Jesus. So back in the back. Um, okay, thank you, thank you so much for looking up for your phone for two seconds. <laughs> Who are you texting? What's your name? Uh, this is about the oh, okay. Oh, excuse me. All right. What's up with you guys, man? You What's guys up? are comedians, right? Yeah. For the people that don't know, you guys are comedians. You guys do stand-up comedy, man. I'm a producer. Oh, you want to get involved now, right? You want to chop in? I was talking to these dudes over here because he wasn't even involved in this conversation. Always the nigga. Always the nigga. But uh, it, it has to be tough being a stand-up comedian in 2020, right? It is, you know what I'm saying? It's been on hold. I've been sitting down doing this shit at my house. When's the last time you did stand up in front of a crowd? Uh, it's been a minute, like in front of like a crowd, crowd, probably February at least. You, know? you miss it? Uh, yeah, definitely miss it, but online's kind of been popping for me. I kind of been getting so? my I, 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 think, I think it must be tough to do um, comedy through like Zoom. It, I mean, it will not necessarily Zoom, but like I kind of have like a cool little following, so I'll just hit live every now and then and get it popping. Oh, okay. OnlyFans? Do you have no, I haven't Only started fans? yet. I haven't fell off that fucking bad yet. <laughs> is, but is that is that falling off though? Because I know a lot of women that make yeah, good money off OnlyFans. They're, they're, those are the yeah. bitches that have implants and shit. I take my no, ass on there. They're like, that's girl, go true. home. I can't compete. No. Uh, I've been making seventy three cents on that. You shit. see, Fargo's like, Fargo's like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Fargo, have you ever gone on OnlyFans? I don't get you in any type of trouble. You just keep it on. You just keep. You just keep the free porn, right? I don't understand. I don't understand why people pay to see women naked when you go on the internet. And you see anything that you. Have. He's acting like his mic doesn't work. He's saying, "Oh, what? Oh, sorry. Is it on? Oh yeah. Let me switch with you." I'm not mad at any girl getting yeah. chips from it, though. I don't understand who's paying for it, but I'm not mad at none of the ladies that's charging. It's your that, that is strange, though, right? I mean, you know, fuck it. Some of these girls showing it for free on Instagram in their driveway, fucking oily floor and shit, you know? Oily. So why See, not? See, that's, that's the hate that came out in you right now. It was, it's not It's a little hate. bit of hate. No, I just don't like driveway, like, photo shoots. Is there somebody doing driveway photo shoots? Driveway you know the bitches shoots. in the driveway and the Instagram, and, like, you're like, I see the oil spot, the little truck in the back. I see you, <laughs> you know? You a just told bit. me about your stand-up comedy on, in your kitchen. Wait, they're, what? They're in my kitchen though, model. yeah, but I don't have like Crisco in the back. Yeah, yeah, I hear you. I try <laughs> to start make somewhere, my right? You, you make it all presentable and yeah, everything like that. Yeah, I don't have like my trash right there or my recycles in the back. You know, but you got to start somewhere, right? Yeah, hey, you got to do what you got to do. I agree. You got to do something, man. Got to get noticed. It, isn't it? It's noticed. Isn't it? Isn't it strange that men pay to see women naked when you can go online and do it for free? Yeah, I've never paid for OnlyFans. Have you ever paid out sex? You hesitate a little bit. No. I, I when you hesitate well, a little well, bit. I have, oh, I, I, have, I, have, I have. Hold on. I have physically paid for sex, but the receipt didn't say pussy. The receipt I can said, promise you that the all you guys at this other table paid for pussy. The receipt said other things. That. I respect that. said entertainment. Food, uh, movies, yeah. and everything like that. Oh, yeah. That's, that's paid for pussy. Yeah. I hear you, man. I respect that. I respect that. What's up, Ty? Have you ever paid for sex? Yeah, yeah. There you go. I respect that. I said, I think all of you guys have <laughs> You saw a little baby, the caught your pussy he got in the last couple of days? Yeah. So he got, he hooked up with his porn star, gave her six G's to have sex, and then she goes on Instagram and tells the whole planet, shows the DMs. Isn't that crazy? That's bad business. Yeah. What would you do in that situation? No comment. Okay, so that's good for the podcast. Yeah. That when somebody says no comment, then we might as well not have the show tonight. Right? Sorry. Sale. All right. I'm sorry, Ty. I hate this. I hate this story, of you, man. How many times have you been on the show, Ty? Like it's been like six, seven times, right? So maybe you think you would know how to act by this point, right? The biggest fucking <laughs> heads in his phone, man. <laughs> Alberto, tell us a little bit about yourself, man. Yo, what's up, man? Big Bob, I'm from Whittier City. You know what I'm saying? Uh, born and raised. I'm an artist. I'm a producer. I'm an engineer. Uh, extraordinaire. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I take pride in my work. I hope you guys. 
Uh, I got I got some, some, some shit coming down, man. Some, uh, what you got coming out, man? I'm I got, you know what? I just did a a, a whole a whole mixtape for my boy Lego. Woo! Lego Nomics, right? It's, it's hot. Yeah, I I think so too. I mean, it's something else, man. You know what I'm saying? We was in the studio, we was vibing, so everybody was vibing. In let's this. let's show the people what happened. I just met you what about an hour ago, right? Yeah, we, we went <laughs> we went to the studio and. Uh, yep. Yeah, and uh, you see Ty's like, I had to wait six months to get on this show. This nigga better been an hour. What the fuck? So, um, yeah. <laughs> I went to, went to the studio when we go to, to Luda and that um, outro for Lego Nama. Right, right, yo. It was awesome, man. You have a great setup over there, too. Oh, thank you, man. Thank you, man. Ain't need some recording, man. You know anybody? You know, I, I know a lot of people, man. man. I know a lot of people. It's quality. Did you see get the intro? I did for Lego's uh, mixtape. I did the intro, the interlude, and the outro. It's the first time I ever did that. I'll never do it for anyone else, but that's my cousin. That's my best friend. That's so right. That's right. Do, right. At least I could do. Did you do like a whole DJ drama thing, or what you do? Like a DJ I just Khaled? do. A, I just do the same stuff I do in my everyday life. What up, this milk and dream young Baka, greatest person on the planet, most handsome person on the planet, stuff like that. You know? I just told a fact. <laughs> so why do you laugh at? So why do you laugh? So why do you laugh at? Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Why do you laugh at that? Hold 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 that? What's so funny about that? It's not supposed to be comedy, nigga. What's what's going on? He's ah. <laughs> right. Yeah, well, I, you know, I got some beats on there too, you know what I'm saying? I got this, you know what I'm saying? So we, we had a good time recording this album. You know what I'm saying? So uh, how long you been recording? How long you been in the hip-hop game? Man, I mean, you know, I was rapping since I was a kid, right? But um long time. Yeah, long time. But uh but uh like I, as far as like you know being an artist and, and exposing myself to the world, you know what I'm saying? Uh like my ten years. Like, well, not, 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 not that long, man. You know what I'm saying? There you go. I respect that, man. <laughs> And then you do track when you walked in the studio too. You, you yeah, kept I know track, I know track from, the, from the first, from the day one, like you know, back in the day, you know what I'm saying? He was one of the first celebrities that I knew. Hey, you know hey man, dude. See, hey, he used to do his thing out here, man. Hey, he's still doing his thing, man. He's still doing his thing. 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 He's still doing had Honcho, you know, he's doing his thing, man. How, how do you feel about comedy in 2020? Now? Um, if you're not trying to get better right now, then you have a problem. I'm like, right point. now, the pandemic That's happened, right. you know, you got to find space time, so hit the online mics. Yeah. Uh, have you done online mics? I've done a bunch of them. Are they a little awkward or do you enjoy them? Very awkward. Uh, I've got booed on the online mic. How do you get booed on the Wait, online mic? Uh, I had a very offensive joke. <laughs> what was the joke? Um, Hold on, Ash. Can you kill it for one second? Yo, you want right, to do, go bits? For it, you want do bits right now? Uh, so y'all want him to say I just want you to one joke. That's all. I just want the one joke. Okay. The, 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 don't, don't step on this guy's joke. Go ahead. The bit was... Um, Look, your big father's day, already laughing. I see you killing big, him. Back in the day, I um, feel like this generation is pussy because nobody believes in assassinating presidents anymore. Like, back in the day, we didn't like a president. We just got rid of him. That's a good you know what I'm saying? That like Abraham Lincoln, J, J, JFK. We just That's got rid of him. But Trump's just out here linging around, you know? But like I, I, snitches are walking around like, the hood too. But I, I, I'm I didn't, sorry, it's true. Like, I you tell him, Fargo. It's true. You tell him, Fargo. I got to let y'all know. We got some mic time for Fargo, right? Time. What it is? Oh, you could, you could ask. You could outside. We got some mic time for Fargo, right? Are you upset? You, 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 you honestly, do you really like? As somebody that's been in the game for a minute, the fact that you see these people like six nine and people like that walking around, telling all their business, telling other people, sorry, telling other people's business, which is more offensive, does that get you upset? You know what, man? I, like, I mean, like. I can tell the way you clinch your no, 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 man. It ain't even like it's like, uh, like, like him personally. I don't even know that man. You know what I'm saying? And, and he I'm, I'm talking. I'm talking about that culture. That culture. How we culture? Do what culture is a snitch culture? Is that what you're saying? Uh, it's, a, it's a culture where there's no repercussions and there's no See, consequence of anything. That's what's how he wrong with the world. Go to jail and he comes, that's comes back and sells five million. There's no repercussions. Yeah. Don't, there's, there's no. There's no. Uh, you know, nothing. For, people don't have nobody to answer to anymore. You know what I'm saying? Back in the day, he used to answer to people. You know what I'm saying? They used to respect people. They used to respect the elders. You know what I'm saying? They ain't got no respect. Nobody got no respect. You know what I'm saying? And I earned my respect a long time ago, and I still now I can feel like I gotta do it again. That's crazy, man. You got fucked up. More people didn't get slapped in the face, right? Yeah, you know I respect saying? that. I respect that, man. You know what I'm saying? But, <laughs> as far as like, no, I respect that. No, hundred percent, man. You know, but but uh, uh, you know, I'm not so Ty Evans. He doesn't talk much, but he respects it too. You okay, Ty? What's up, man? Have some more drink or something, man. Usually the funniest dude I know when you get on the show, and you're like, like hey, you no comment. So okay, okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, you right, you right. Oh, yeah, so no, no, yeah, I feel you, but it, it does, it, it is, it's like the wild, wild west now, man. The internet makes everything crazy, you have people, you know what's really crazy, you have people beef, like different hoods beefing, and now you have dudes 
pop out on, on the projects and take videos of it and things like that. That's crazy, man. You know what's crazy, man, is like if you're the one that says, let's go outside to take a walk outside, yeah. man, then you, you, you fucking asshole. Yeah. Nobody even want to take a walk no more, yeah. man. I just take a walk. Oh, oh, why, why you know crazy? Why are you doing man, that? Yeah, yeah. Why are you getting crazy? Right, somebody man, explain. Why are you getting no loud, what's bro? Let's go take a walk. What's taking a walk? So no, me and you have an issue. I say, all right, let's take a walk. We can go handle it. We don't have to. We don't have to. We don't have to point out the spot. We don't have to. Wait, just me. Yeah. Nobody, nobody gonna look at it. We're gonna go in the alley. All right, take care. My question is, do you have the strap? That's what I want to. No, 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 no. Find us. I'm gonna show you how. You know, just take it. Yeah, some people might say. I always got the strap. I'm gonna use like, this shit, bro. If you tell me, let's take a walk, I, I'm always assuming you, so what you like got the strap. I'm gonna But if somebody said, so I wouldn't say, let's take a walk, well, I wouldn't do anything because so I'm an angel. I'm, I'm, I'm just saying, <laughs> some people, so they may say, you know, I'm an angel. Dudes <laughs> wouldn't say, let's take a walk, and you think they're gonna just shoot you? So your, your defense is you're saying, fuck that. I'm saying right here in front of everyone so everyone can see. I mean, my in my defense, I'm gonna go off based off the energy that you're giving me. So I'm me he's from another hole, like, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, like, this thing don't even get a call to say, you know what I'm saying? If you give me, if you get, get, like, if you give me killer yeah. vibes, I'm, I'm probably not going to go outside with you. No, if it's one person, then when they say take a walk, then make sure you just walk kind of far from the house. Right. Like, See, so he knows something. So you can just pop it off for a minute before you get jumped by yourself. So you don't make a scene. So go outside. If they say, let's go for a walk, like, okay, but don't stop till I feel like we stop. We're going for a walk. We're now. So you just screw with that, Ty. If me and you have an issue, it might not like be in that place house, where you know sometimes what I'm saying? Like, like, like if you, nah, Ty that's, knows what's up. That's in someone's house to sit, you know what I no, mean? No, it like, does, but that's where the respect comes in. Mean, we can't fight so every fucking way. Don't bust up. Let's take a walk. Let's take a walk. We'll see that. That's why she popped in the middle of the That's another subject. The Midwest, I had to live in the Midwest man. alone. I'm from Detroit, so. You from Detroit? Yeah, I'm from Detroit. Yeah, I'm from Detroit. I'm I'm Detroit. Detroit. Midwest is a whole other area. Yeah, yeah. Crazy America. So how, how long have how how long, how long you been out here now? Oh, I've been out here for a minute now. I can bullshit. I've been out here for like 14. Oh, there you go. And how old like are you now? Two years. It's cold out there. I'm like five years. I'm okay with my age. I'm okay with my age. I said, I'm Hold on, ass. Cut the music. No, I'm playing. I'm playing. <laughs> <laughs> no, I said, I'm okay. I'm okay with my age. I'm yeah. Before. People, do do women get offended when other, than when people ask them how, how old they are now? No. I, I know Ty gets offended, but I, he's a I don't, I don't get offended. <laughs> I, you know what pisses me off even more? <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, I know. You know what pisses me off more? Like, uh, for some reason, it pisses me off when people look at me and assume that I don't have a kid because I'm small. Like if I be like, oh, I have That's a kid, they're like, you? no, you That's fucking what kid don't. You see that little like, flex yeah, bubble? I, I hate when people look at me and they're like, you're way too skinny and hot to have a kid. I'm like, no. first of all, you know. No, because see I really flex? Yeah, okay. No. So, so, you, so so like, like, I'm so skinny and so sexy. They look at me they're like, there's no way you're going to I'm like, how the hell are you? It's right? a different offense when people, they treat me a certain on, way. It's a mo- no, I'm telling you come right on. now. Shut up. When I'm with my child, I have a... Shut on my show. We can take a walk right now. We can take a walk. Remember I told you we walk in a minute. Oh, we can we can take the walk, but we walk in closer to my car than yours. <laughs> there you go, there you go. <laughs> we walk in straight to my car. So but you get offended when people say you're too small and sex up. No, I just get offended when people try to like. It's kind of funny, you know, because like I said, I am 34 years old. So when people just look at me and assume like you hey, just some skinny little heifer, don't know mm-hmm. shit, don't come at me like that. When I know how to make greens like everybody else, you know. What I'm saying? I think you're taking a free like brain brain order. Brain. She's just brain. trying to stunt. That's all she's doing. No, man. I think. And now y'all ask me what I take a Happy white shit with a smile. Like, I, I was, I was very smart. skeptical you about asking Are your you age because that? I know women yeah, okay. really get mad at that. No, 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 I'm 34. I'm okay with that. Okay. I'm 34. I'm an 80s baby. It's okay, man. All day, every day, 80s baby. I'm very proud to be an 80s baby, especially today. <laughs> there you go, man. So, all day. We got shout out to the 90s, though. 90s babies. How old are you? 90s babies? 28. I'm 29. I'm actually 30. I just, I just, I just turned 30 a month ago. But what are you, like, 90, though? I was born in 1990, yeah. Yeah, 90. So, your mom was... Of course, I won't be talking about my mom on no, my show. No, I mean, show, you okay? were pregnant in 90, and she was pregnant in 89, right? Like, you like mid 90s? Uh, well, I was born in September. Uh, she's probably. Oh, so I'm not trying to figure out. I, I appreciate you, you coming on the show. 90s, I appreciate you coming on the show, but I'm not trying to figure out when my mom got impregnated. You know what I'm saying? It's like, okay, so you know it was Christmas, and then maybe, uh, you know. I'm trying to figure out if you was really with the 80s gang or if you were with the 90s. No, I'm not done with the 80s gang. No, no, not at all, not at all, man. So you're a 90s baby, though. Okay. I'm that age thing, sorry. Yeah, I we, say. I mean, it's a few more 80s at the table. <laughs> yeah. I'm apologizing, sorry. <laughs>
No, the 80s baby is them. 80s was, it, it was a different lifestyle then, it really was, and I don't care what nobody say, 80s, that, that you're not fucking with that yeah, era, like period, it was like, no, everything, creative, Seven is eight, you know what y'all going with? From then to now, it's like, it's a sad thing, man, it really is. Alright, all right, what, what's your favorite genre of music, 70s, 80s, 90s, 2000s? No, see, don't do that to me, because I've heard Detroit, like I said, Motown, you know so then good, I gotta man. take it back, Motown, you know what I mean, I gotta take it Early, early nineties, early nineties. Uh oh. You mean like hip hop or just? I'm just saying, just just genre, just genre of music, just like. You can talk talking about Tony, Tony, Tony shit. What's your favorite genre? Nineties. Nineties. Okay. What do you mean? Well, cause like I read this post, it was like, what's your music? Music. Favorite genre of music? Nineties. Time? I will and definitely yeah, say you know that yeah, yeah. sitcom, as far as sitcoms, Attitude. 90 not sitcoms is definitely the, You're not here. fucking with the 90 sitcoms at all. There's just too many. That was the last of, that was the last of the like real suit. You know? Favorite 90 sitcom? 90s. I mean, I, I gotta give it to Will Smith and the Fresh, Fresh Prince. Fresh Prince, like, what's up? You're not, it was, was educational, <laughs> back good, in. good. Evan. Back in. <laughs> back in. <laughs> she gave me the back end, that's okay. I'm going Fresh Prince. Uh, from the little children. <laughs> hey, not even a lie. Of all time? From the 90s. Uh, Boy Meets World. Boy Meets World? Boy Meets World. That's a good Which one? It's not bad. That's not bad. It's yeah. okay. You can oh, go with Boy Meets World. It's World. World. some good life that one. They, they, they was. Alright, uh, good. Yeah. Lines from the grab, we're hand to hand like preachers pitching scams. We for Billy Graham, what you portray, I really am. Broke kilogram down the milligram, to share it with my fam. Trash bags full of grass like landscapers, big Donkey Kong barrels. We needed hammers to break it, red plate greens, just needed cash to shape it. Good things come to those who think it's worth the taking. Went from Manila bags, two and a half, gold nickel, the 448 took me back. At first I couldn't stomach it, then I acquired a taste with it. I'm getting it, six giving up, they grind me face with it Past charges was enough, I don't want another case with it But I'll shoot for the stars, I'll leave bodies in outer space for it huh. Yeah, I know, some don't understand it But it's not yeah. what I was made to do, it's what we was raised to do Back at it like I never left it Trying to wash my hands clean like I never chefed it Bunch of bitches I made cream, but I never slept with I never admit a thing, got no recollection I did it all without doing the most Cop so much butter from the blood and doing the toast I let the fly eagle fly, come get you a Desi I'm clipping all heads, come get you a Freshie This a different kind of sport, it won't get you an SB But niggas good fellas, bitch, come get you a Pepsi We did this shit in life, while others did it in they verse I'm the kind of nigga you gotta ask to kill a nigga first That 
means I'm me. Got the same polo hoodie, about 16 shades. So many niggas on a pound, we broke in 16 ways. I kept flipping, caught my own pound in 16 days. Uh. Niggas gotta start somewhere, but it ain't how you start, it's how you finish, and this shit ain't over. You see, I started from the bottom, the finish line not in sight yet. It's digital analog, iPhone with a tape deck. I sip cold bets, roll dice with what's left. Couple hundred on the ground, anticipating the flex. You gotta approach me at the little respect. Out your neck is how you talking before you know it's just a body to bless. It's hardly the stress, I'm blessed, but in the hump of success. Yes, I still want it all amongst the civil unrest. Fresh is how I keep it moving. Enjoy the sneakers, nice to meet you. you think you know me, homie, I can't recall, maybe the reefer. Out the speakers, just the real, like some righteous teeth. Just really do or die, so off top I just swing for bleachers The streets are crazy, they kill you in that next day Shit, stay stressful, 100 roaches in the ashtray Need some fast pay in a fast way like yesterday Smoke another dozen blunts and cast the stress away Slum the motherfucking resident The park bench profit Product of my environment Poverty USA I rap that nigga uh. You already know what the fuck it is though man this here for my street niggas and all my niggas in the projects For all my hustlers up in the kitchen, cooking coke in that Pyrex Niggas out here hating on me, ask me if I give a fuck I got killers that kill killers, my killers can't wait to let them guns bust Bitch you looking at a real nigga, so recognize a real nigga Those that know me know I ain't no phony, I always keep it trill nigga Fuck your swag and fuck your swag Nigga, this be that G shit When I was younger, they used to tell me that I ain't never gonna be shit Twelve years old, started smoking weed Sixteen, slanging crack Eighteen, dedicated To these streets and making cash Now you read about me on the magazines See my fat ass on the TV screen But I'm still posted on the block Because real niggas do real things Purple weed, purple drink Syrup though, no Waffle House Round here, we wildin' out And we ride around with them choppers out Nigga, bang Bang, bang, bang. Hey, Tim, my name is Milk and Jake We are tuned back into episode 110 of the B-Side What was your question, Big Paul? I didn't mean to cut you off I was gonna say, man, oh, are you gonna play some of the music tonight? We gonna play some of your music tonight? Or are you still holding on to that big stage? Oh, it's, it's producer, Ty, he's a comedian, man. I know it doesn't seem like it on the show. Yeah. Oh, okay. He's a comedian. I know he doesn't seem like it on the show, but you know, <laughs> he, he tries his best, man. <laughs> tries his best. That was funny, huh, Tess? Thank you. When Tess laughs at, I know it's, I know it's funny because she doesn't he laugh at any of my jokes. But he he's from Chicago. He can rap. Oh, you want another shot? <laughs> yeah, oh, you right. didn't even finish your shot. You got right. man. Two so shows. Oh, that's you know you are. Yeah. You're from Chicago. You that's can right. rap. Like, Why you from Memphis? Why you from Chicago all of a sudden, man? Nah, oh, man. Every time I talk to this nigga, he's from a different where, neighborhood. So, where, where, where are you, where are you, you from? Is that crazy? Okay, that's cool. I'm from the Brooklyn by way of Memphis, and I go to Chicago. And I'm from... Man, Ty, you messed that's up. You messed up my flow. You messed up. You messed up my flow that day, man. Somebody's like, "Where you from?" I said, "I'm from New York." And this nigga Ty's like, "Nigga, you ain't from." I want to say, man, shut up, Ty. I'll be always hooking you up, and you, man, you embarrass me like that in front of somebody, man. I actually told my boy I had my back, man. Jeez, dude. Hey, let me ask you something, man, because uh, that that Jeezy and that Gucci, I think that was extremely out of pocket, uh, disrespectful. If let me put it in perspective, if me and you have beef and you kill Lego, and me and you do a song later, that's that's bad. That's bad on me. That's bad calm on me, right? How's it different? Sex tree, sex tree. Oh, that's what I was asking you, man. For the people that, oh yeah, go ahead. We're hey, doing the show. I, I think it'd be bad karma on you. We can't have too many black people on the show because it's like out, it's out of control, man. Wow. We're in the middle of a fucking Whoa. show. This nigga. I'm gonna go step over here. Stop. Stop. Hold up. Okay, what, what are you gonna say? What are you say? Why is it different? Tell me. I'm asking you because I don't know. You tell me. 
Gucci what was up, so by the time they walked in, we were it was already on, right? Yeah. On like back in, man. Yeah. I don't know. I think it's a, it's a little weird, but what do I know, man? Um, what's popped with you, man? What you got coming up, man? I know for the people that don't know, we do Inglewood every Saturday night, man. Um, I Shout out to y'all. Okay, well, let's not talk about that then. <laughs> we do Saturday. You see, man, I'm trying to wild you up. I said, we do Saturday every Saturday. He's like, yeah, yeah. And I got this <laughs> coming up. And then, you know, no, we do I'm Saturday every Saturday. Like, like, what's like, popping? What's popping? Voodoo Village. The movie, true story, based on a true story out of Memphis. That's that's coming. It's in development now. Dope. We got Third Wheel, the TV show that I've been working on for years. Word. That's in development. We got an animation coming out. Hopefully that be in development. I don't know if got that. Is it of you? Huh? Is it you? What? The little, little animated type of it. I mean, I'm animation. Actually, I'm actually trying to get a roll on. How, how long have you been doing the, the TV show? For a minute now, right? Yeah, for a few years? Couple of years yeah. And how many times have you been on the show? A lot, right? Uh -huh. You've been on the show a lot. Yeah. Uh, and how, every time you come on the show, I say, hey, let's hook me up with a part. And you always say, I got you, nigga. And now we're all <laughs> six years in, and you're like, oh, yeah, yeah, I got you, nigga. <laughs> Just tell me I'm not going to be honest. I'm so, 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 oh, thank you. Yeah. As long as you still got me, that's all that. Next question is the animation for the game. Sorry about that. I got the special that I want to do at this spot. 1040 because next year is such a, a special year, you know what I mean? So I'm going to prison. Well, explain uh, what it is, man. Uh, explain what it is, 1040. 1040, um, I've been out 10 years, I did 10 years, uh, and I'll be 40. So I'm going to tell everybody. I'm going to tell everybody. Go on, boy. Yeah, I might get blackballed. <laughs> you gotta do what you gotta do, right? Yeah. That's going on Amazon. Then I want to do something um, for comics, like four or five comics, like the Jeff Comedy Jam. I got the green lights today. So I just gotta come up with a fast See what the green light looks like. Yeah. Different. It's like, oh. Yeah, so that one, that's dope, yeah, man. So Congratulations, Ty. You know, I, 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 I tell everybody, man, I appreciate you. I think you're one of the funniest dudes alive, man. I, I appreciate you rocking with us every Saturday, man. So, um, you know, it, it, yeah, I just host. He hosts. Man, this thing always be down, down playing what we do. He's like, oh, yeah, just host a little time. No, man, come on, man. Jeez. But we do, we do uh, for the people who don't know, uh, in a private location in Inglewood every Saturday, we do hip hop and, uh, uh, comedy hosted by Ty Evans, man, and it's, it's been a great time, man. It's been really funny. You coming to Saturday? There you go. Let's go. He, has he invited you a couple Sunday times? A <laughs> okay, so what's the problem? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, listen, listen. So I'm gonna be honest with you. I went back in the booth right now, and I was like, "Why is your Why is your cam on a delay?" And Jackson, what you talking about? I said, "That's me right there." And I saw it was you. I said, "Oh fuck!" <laughs> oh shit! I was like, "Damn, okay." But it is what it is, man. That's hilarious. And like like Ty was saying, man, we do comedy in Reseda on Sunday nights, man. Uh, we do comedy from eight to eleven in uh, in Reseda, a special location. At an underground bar that's, you know, we're doing our thing. And then this week we have uh, the Trap Boys. Shout out to Trap Boys. They're going to be headlining it, man, which I'm super excited about. Dudes from Bacoima, man. So we it, man. And uh, you're performing this Saturday, right? Yes, hold on, man. hold on, hold on. <laughs> if you say you're going to do it on camera, on in front camera. of all these cameras, that yeah. means you have to do it. Yes, I'm going to do it this Saturday. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate it for, you know. So, all right, I'll hang out with you little niggas. Yeah, no, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. You I want some wild card time? Alright, let's. Uh, yeah, all right, I, I feel like, just a little bit, just a little bit, just a little bit. When's the last time you did um, a co stand up comedy sent for the people? February, and then you were doing it every week before that, or what do you think? Um, probably you at Make least sure like it. once a month. I was like hitting up kind of like the slide bar in Orange County and stuff like that, doing like open mics in downtown Fullerton. How is that? Explain that to me, man, because I always have this stigma. I'm sorry, man. I always have this stigma that um, Orange County doesn't like people like us. I'm going to keep it 100 with you. I am so out of place in OC, and I always have been. 
but there it, it's getting a little bit better now the some places so why would you want to be in a place try. that doesn't like doesn't want you no down. some places i'm not even gonna try like huntington and newport and areas like hey that. guys we're recording a podcast over here if you guys don't mind jeez we're dude. leaving, Sorry, we leaving that part alone like orange like, hold on hold on which parts part. are you leaving alone we're leaving alone like the newport huntington and I like shit like that. We're leaving them alone. Huntington Beach is cool. You seem like you would like Huntington. Yeah, let's go. Do you tell us? Right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, 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 right I'm comfortable. I'm comfortable. You seem like. I didn't mean it. I didn't. No, yeah. Not. No, uh, yeah. Yeah. No. But I didn't know. Huntington is like, no, it's. What do you mean when he's, you seem like the type that would like that? I would. Um, he seems more like you catch him at the beach more than at the block. You, you would definitely saying? not catch me at, catch the at the beach. He's like, I hate the beach. Catch me at the beach. That's oh, fucking well. fighting words where I come from. I, 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 block. I could never get into anywhere in Huntington Beach, man. I, 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 didn't got my, I, I didn't got my, my, my street cred. I didn't build my street credit up. You feel me? Like, where you, where are you from originally? I don't mean to make fun of you. Sorry, sorry, these, sorry, these making fun of you, man. Where, where I'm you not making fun of I told you, I'm not sitting by you no more because you like, you keep on like, you kicking me in the chin. Hold on, make sure you explain what I'm doing because people are going to be like, yo. You're like, like you're squeezing me do. right now. You should have talked about Ty. Ty talked about how much, like last episode, Ty talked about how much kids he had and he forgot his answer because he has different answers. How many answers. did you have? <laughs> I was messaging you. I'm messaging you. I apologize. I apologize. It's a conversation for a different time. But where are you from? It's originally? not about so how many kids No, no, no. Let's no, stop. Let's oh, stop. Let's stop. Let's stop. Let's stop. Cause I, cause that's, I, I, it's not in my business. Broke up my relationship. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's talk about how did I break up your relationship. No, no, I didn't break up your relationship. You lying ass broke up your relationship. So don't come over here on my show blaming on me, right? Hey, 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 no, because you're gonna say no, 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 how many baby mamas that make it an issue? You can have a bunch of kids, but if there's a bunch of no, baby mamas, my kids, mom, that might be a oh, oh, my Okay. Kids. Yeah, yeah. Oh, they go. Wait, he said all my kids. They go, they go. How many baby mamas? That's all it is. Yo, I am just being damn, man. man. I am just being doing this thing. He was locked up for 10 years. He was locked up for 10 years. He was like an animal, man. He was like a fucking animal, dude. It doesn't matter. You can mean three to five. How many? Huh? You can mean like three to five. Yeah, like well, a few oh. is three. A few is three. That's fine. Never three. Couple is two. A few is three. Are we three. saying baby mamas or are we saying kids? We're, saying, we're talking about the, ba- the baby mamas. I know baby mamas are kids. I don't know. You gotta ask him, man. It's not mine. <laughs> this nigga never wants to shut up, and now he's like. <laughs> so, you know, <laughs> originally. I'm sorry, I don't want to cut no, you off. Uh, oh. oh, man. No, <laughs> no, no, I'm good. Please change the subject. Damn, we, we all this. Where are you from originally? Because I know you live in Oceanside, right? I live in Oceanside. I'm originally from Maryland. Uh, what part of Maryland are you from, man? Edgewood, Chevy Maryland. Chase. Edgewood, Baltimore. Maryland. There you go. Uh, if you're looking for it, it's like 20 minutes from Baltimore. With a lot of people that look like you? No, no. There's not a lot of people that look like you. No, no, no. That's what she was trying to say. No, no. Why is the gutter? No, that's why I want to ask now. Listen, I don't know if Oceanside is the gutter, but I hear what you're saying. No, no, no. Oceanside is... I have a friend who was in the military. That's how I moved out here. Oh, okay. I figured that. Okay. That makes sense now. Because Oceanside is military. How long you guys been together? Not together. Well, they ain't Camp Pendleton, but they be living. As long as Lake is laughing, that's yeah. all I care about, yeah, dude. Like you, <laughs> you can't, can't assume. Never together. I can't assume. You're right. I can't assume. I can't assume it. Um, so he said, hey, move out here. I got the spot. Yeah. Out. Yeah, yeah. And you said, okay, cool. I'll do you. I, I love cool you. I'll do anything for you. And then do you enjoy where you're at or do you wish you were more in L.A.? I mean, like, I feel like Oceanside kind of fits my have. personality because I'm just chill and relaxed. Like, L.A. is more city life. And, like, before I moved out here, it was either two places. California or New York, and I was like, "Do I really want to live in New York? I'm scared of rats, so it's not gonna work for me." I hate you, man. I respect it. I would go nuts in Oceanside. I hate Oceanside. In New York too, though. What? I think he would have done well in New York too. There you go. I respect that. that Until 2020. Yeah, it's 2020. Yeah. You can't judge time. New York is just <laughs> stacked up. Yeah, that's crazy New York out is there, man. Stacked, nah, stacked, it would have been well, but for comedy, I don't think New York is right now. You're just talking about love. It's always Hollywood. It's Hollywood, right? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, it's more. Like Hollywood's Hollywood. always been Hollywood. What, New Yorkers? No, oh, okay. Comedy, comedy, comedy. I don't know, man. Like the cellar and stuff like that in New York? I did. Like, Caroline. Yeah, yeah, you don't like none of that stuff? I mean, not to live. I love New York, man. I, you know, it's amazing, dude. But I understand. You're a country, dude. Stuff you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just playing with you. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. So 
so you do enjoy outside. You ever want to go back home? Or you think this that's gonna be a forever home? Um, I don't know. I, I like to see what what holds, what's gonna happen. You know, I had no plans to move in Ocean Side. I was like California, wherever I can get to, that's where I'm gonna go. How old are you? How old are you? Twenty eight. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, and how long how long you been out here now? Uh, like a year and a half. There you go. So, and you already hanging out with Young Bach and Ty hey, Evans, man. Right, shout, right, out man to moves. It, shout out to going to Oceanside yeah, out yeah, here. Yeah, it's yeah. expensive. Yeah, making there. moves. It's, it's nice in Oceanside. That's what I'm saying. Shout out. No. You haven't even been here for two You years like living in Orange County? Time. You moved from Detroit to Orange County? See, yeah. That has to be a shock. That was a cover. Look, it was a. <laughs> You know that's a cover. It was a, it was a, <laughs> nah, for real. It was a, it was a serious culture shock for me. You know what I'm saying? Because I, you dropped me off in middle school, and like I finally found out what like a tola was. Like no, you know what I'm saying? Like I was like the fuck, like because I'm in Oceanside. No, I'm, I'm in Orange County. Orange County? Okay, Orange County. I'm in Anaheim. Orange County. I didn't know you're in Anaheim. No, I'm in Anaheim. 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 Like, I'm sorry, I didn't know you're in Anaheim. No, yeah, I'm in Anaheim. What, what Disneyland's at? I got you. I apologize. Oh uh, fuck up. You said you're in Anaheim. This kid was fucked by Disneyland. I was gonna say, please, are you yeah. kidding me? I was gonna say, hold on. Oh, no, hey, homie. This is go. No, I hey, went. Homie. This is me. Ghetto I went two miles from Santa Ana. Okay. Like, Santa Ana. I don't know nothing, but it's ghetto. Santa Ana in Orange County, it is kind of getting a little more rough, little yeah, tougher. It's ghetto. It is. She's from Detroit. She's like, yeah, it's Santa Ana. Santa Ana's big ghetto. Yeah, I was gonna say, I enjoyed it for y'all guys. Hey, much love to my people from Santa Ana. You know what I'm saying? No disrespect. You know what I'm saying? You guys keep it rough, though. You know what I'm saying? Santa Ana, Bobby. Santa Ana, you know Oh, man, I'll, I'll, take, I'll take your word for it, man. No, I'll, I'll keep hey, it 100 for you. you for it. You got to take my word. Yeah. I'm like, why is Santa Ana so bad? Like, it really is bad over there. Yeah, like, it is. I'm like, like, you know yeah. what, though, man? It's beautiful, though, in some parts, too. It you know, is. No, don't get nice me wrong. Orange County in general is, like, a beautiful place. Mama, yeah, man, you know. When I moved out here, I was a kid. We didn't want. My mama didn't want to take me from Detroit and drop me off in the middle of fucking Eaglewood. Like, let's go. She wanted to get rid of one, like, polar opposite. So we came to OC. I was like, damn, I'm going to Knox and shit after school. I was like, what the fuck? But it was, a, a, like you said, a come up from Detroit. Like, I was like, hey, I'm waiting. Have you ever been back to Detroit or you never been? I went back to Detroit at like um, 20 years old, but we just, everybody, now that we're here, I see my family a lot, but they bring their ass here. They're like, there's no point. They fuck around in my state, they're like, I ain't leaving. They <laughs> come out here. You say you know, leave me, I ain't leaving. You gonna go leave. back over there, oh? Back. Um, this is the thing. I'm kind of from a lot of places. I lived in Arizona for a little bit. So some of my family that was in Detroit, they're in Arizona now. So I just skipped I ain't to even AZ. Make no jokes, see the family. Oh. oh. You can make them no. all you want. We went from blizzards to lizards. You know what I'm saying? That's dope. Arizona's hot, Arizona hot. I like that. Arizona hot is so hot. We blizzards to lizards. Yeah, Arizona's too hot. They don't like I people like us anymore. Them. I'm half black, half Mexican. That's double. They don't like They don't like double. anybody yeah. over there. My family, they work for like, some of my family work for the prison out there. They make you like them Arizona, Arizona time. In America. Talk your mic. Yeah. Yeah, there you go. What, what's, what's so special about Arizona? There had to be a woman out there that makes you like it, right? Okay, listen, you can hate Arizona, but from yeah, right now like, until like April, it's the best place to live. Okay, what? Yeah, I ain't never heard of Buckeye in my life, dude. Why about Why does a brother like you? Why actually, you've been in a lot of places. You've been in Iowa. Idaho. You've been Idaho. 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 Id
you would have, I would have said the dope shit out of here. Hold on, hold on. So, what was your first, the grand, grand master? What was your first question to him? Did you say that I did it? I did that shit out of him. I didn't know. Wait, hold on. You guys, what's the first question? How did you end up meeting this dude? What led up to that? I'm not <laughs> I did my little, I did my little, you know, my little roots. What did he, did he answer the door with a robot? Like, shit, how do you know he's like, he was like, hey, uh, hey, Max, hey, Big he was like, boy, I don't even like your cat. Oh, shit. Wow. But you was a funny nigga. Oh, damn, but hey, but yeah, can you tell me what you, do you, do you still remember what the spill was? You would walk up there? It was different. Damn. Yeah, so I, so I, I, you, I never go ahead been knock, part of the Go ahead and yeah. knock. You knock over the door and say, what's up, buddy? What did you say? What did you say? I did handle this for you. Oh, hey, what's going on, man? How can you help me? I'm interested in what hey, handle this shit. Okay, what's the thing? Oh, of course, shit, guys. <laughs> you fucking remember that you said it five million times, bro. Oh, for the name of the grand wizard, you know your pitch. For the women, I don't remember. What was the pitch to women? I'm like, uh, hey, how's it going, Miss America? And then they did. I'm gonna use this one. I'm gonna use this one. And then she gonna say, where you from? I'm gonna say, I'm from New York. And Tyler's like, Thanks a lot, man. So you, you knocked on this dude's door. He opened up with the white hood. No, nah, he didn't have no I actually sat in this house. What? Uh, what? Yeah, yeah. This nigga cool. tells you I don't like people like you, but you a funny nigga. Cool. Come on inside. You say, oh. I have to sell the queen. I have to sell the queen. What was your name? That's the first thing you told you? But the dude put the gun out. What would you say? Oh, put a gun out? No, the, the guy that pulled the gun out, I saw him too. The girl that was with me um, is the single Latoya Lucky best friend. She was from Houston, her night to court. She peed on herself when he put the gun. I'm mad at the cheat, right? Latoya Lucky took the thing and she's going through the door to tell him to clean it. Yeah, it must be pissed off. But this, no, nah, this is before she grew up. This is before they. Yeah. I don't like your kind. Have a seat. No, the dude <laughs> pulled the gun now. I saw him too, though. I remember what I said to him. Cause I was kind of scared because he, you know, he had to gun in my head. I said, when I got clean, that gun too, sir. And he started laughing. He so, uh, dedicated. He tried to get you the status, right? Because I was just like, all right, I'm out. I'm uh, out. I, 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 I didn't say one of the things I didn't go to him. I actually had to leave, though. So comedy say you had to leave? Why did you have to leave? Nah. Why did you have to leave? Nah, I did that for some other reason. Why did you have to leave? I was going to run. And then, uh. That's why you didn't We got four dogs. Oh, you left out of the because you was on the floor. Yeah. Oh, I this is a good place to live. Yeah. 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 They told me to leave the state. Leave the state, just better off you just get going. Nah, they t- they told everybody in the, in the band, you gotta go. About a mile, you know what I'm saying? But that's dope to give you the heads up, buddy. Yeah. That's dope of them. Yeah. Give you the heads up. They didn't just arrest you. That was dope. Yeah. But they could have. They, 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 they want a family. It's great. There you go. We started falling back in the minute, baby. I'm trying to carry all you moves.
Somebody talk to me. Man, I'm really out here tripping. Take a walk with me. Homies ain't been homies. Shit getting tricky. Badass in the set. Bitches call me Ricky. Ay, but I don't want the bitch. I want the trash. Pulled off a deuce. Yeah, I might crash. Going hella fast. Cause 200 sitting on the dash. And I ain't sharing no lane. Big body Hellcat. Ay, big body Hellcat. Ay, ask about Boosie. Yeah, I'm all that. Ay, look. Yeah, I'm him and not them. Ay, look. Yeah, I'm him and not them. Somebody walk with me, cause these demons in my head trying to talk to me. If you ask me, this shit getting hella crazy. Used to do skits and buckets, now we slime and say, Hey, I'm really tripping, yeah, that's on my mama. Wait, scratch that, cause she ain't in this. I swear to God, y'all gonna be mad when I get rich. And when you hear this, I ain't taking back shit. Man, my pride hella big, bitch, nigga, get tipped. Shoot you just like this beat, nigga, you get ripped. PPS on my team, bitch, I was born to win. Just wait till I pull up on the fire with the pen. Any questions in my answers? That the rappers get it in, bitch. Ay, big body Hellcat, ay. Ask about Boosie, yeah, I'm all that, ay. Look, yeah, I'm him and not them, ay. Look, yeah, I'm him and not them, little bitch, ay. Yeah, I'm him and not them. All my niggas stay the tip, yeah, I'm him and not them, ay. <laughs> yeah, I'm him and not them, ay. Look, yeah, I'm him and not them. Yeah, I'm him and not them. Big double R shit, we coming for the win. I'ma slide in the beamer, I'ma slide in the bands. I'm a grown ass man, I don't do no friends. And if a nigga keep talking, we gon' touch his chin. We thugging and we thugging all the way to the end. All these bitches on the click, they want the double R dick. And all these niggas tuned in, they all this double R shit. The only rabbits on the block, and we was quick to flip bricks. Big body Hellcat, ayy. Ask about Boosie, yeah, I'm all that, ayy. Look, yeah, I'm him and not them, ayy. Look, yeah, I'm him and not them, look. Somebody talk to me. Man, I'm really out here tripping. Take a walk with me. Homies ain't been homies. Shit getting tricky. Badass in the set. Bitches call me Ricky. Ay, but I don't want the bitch. I want the trash. Pulled off a deuce. Yeah, I might crash. Going hella fast. Cut 200 sitting on the dash. And I ain't sharing no lane. Big body Hellcat. Ay, big body Hellcat. Ay, ask about Boosie. Yeah, I'm all that. Ay, look. Yeah, I'm him and not them. Ay, look. Yeah, I'm him and not them. Somebody walk with me, cause these demons in my head trying to talk to me. If you ask me, this shit getting hella crazy. Used to do skits and buckets, now we slime and say, Hey, I'm really tripping, yeah, that's on my mama. Wait, scratch that, cause she ain't in this. I swear to God, y'all gonna be mad when I get rich. And when you hear this, I ain't taking back shit. Man, my pride hella big, bitch, nigga, get tipped. Since you just like this beat, nigga, you get ripped. PBS on my team, bitch, I was born to win. Just wait till I pull up on the fire with the pen. Any questions in my answers? That the rappers get it in, bitch. Ay, big body Hellcat, ay. Ask about Boosie, yeah, I'm all that, ay. Look, yeah, I'm him and not them, ay. Look, yeah, I'm him and not them, little bitch, ay. Yeah, I'm him and not them. All my niggas stay the tip, yeah, I'm him and not them, ay. <laughs> yeah, I'm him and not them, ay. Look, yeah, I'm him and not them. Yeah, I'm him and not 
thin. Big double R shit, we coming for the win. I'ma slide in the beamer, I'ma slide in the bands. I'm a grown ass man, I don't do no friends. And if a nigga keep talking, we gon' touch his chin. We thugging and we thugging all the way to the end. All these bitches on the click, they want the double R dick. And all these niggas tuned in, they all this double R shit. The only rabbits on the block, and we was quick to flip bricks. Big body hill cat, ayy. What up, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Samir Kachim Young Baka. If you want me to buy presents for your kids this Christmas, I got you. Just give me the word. And as long as you put it as close to your mouth as you can, I got you. You good to go? Go ahead and introduce yourself. Hey, she's trying to introduce herself. Go ahead. I'm Carmelita Jones. Where do I look? Where's my camera? These are all cameras, so it doesn't matter. He's going to be in whatever camera. Hi, I'm Carmelita Jones. Where do I look? Where's my camera? Hi, Carmelita Jones. Where do I look? Where's my camera? Hi, I'm Carmelita Jones. Where do I look? Where's my camera? And I'm always writing for you, too. Or talk about you, I promise. You ever seen a dating show? That's what you're sounding like right now. Uh, my name is Hunt, and I'm from Chicago, and I'm definitely funny. And, uh, and you're also 50 minutes late, right? What time did Ty tell you to be here? Okay, I saw the 845 text when I was already driving, and I had already left like 20 minutes late. There you go. That's how it goes, right? When you're hot, you can just do whatever you want. You know what I'm saying? No, that's, that's not how that works. I still got bills. That is not how that works oh, yeah. at all. So how long have you been in L.A. now? It was one. Oh, wow. I moved here they officially pay a couple on bills October 19th. October 19th of yep. last year? No, of this year, 2020. Oh, so you... you I'm fresh, you fresh. Fresh in here, man. Fresh. How do you feel fresh. so far? How are you enjoying it? Um, I'm adjusting to not having snow. Do you miss the snow or do you want snow? No, I don't miss that shit. Yeah, snow sucks, <laughs> right? Nah. It's all snow, and, snow and, and that crushy. Shit, and it's it's, it's awful, man. Dude. So tell me three good things about LA and tell me three bad things about LA. Three good things about LA. The sunshine. Woo. Um, shit. I like to eat and it's like a nice, I like Asian food and they got like all the Asians yeah. and all the Asian <laughs> foods yeah. out here. So I fuck with that heavy. And uh, these are things I like. I fuck with Asians. Asians. Just be sure. So I like Asian all food, and these Asians, we got all these Asians over here. Asian you got fucking this Asian, you got this Asian, all, all these niggas Asian, man. You, like, all, you like all Asians? Yeah. I like all Asian food. Let's make, the, the, let's, Asian make, food. let's make your favorite Asians your least favorite Asians. <laughs> Go ahead. Don't do it. My least favorite is Korean. No, I like Koreans because they be having the bomb ass beauty supplies. The Vietnamese be hooking up the nails. The Chinese got the barbecue ducks that I fuck with. I like that too. I like that Thai curry. And now I just found out about the Desi boys, the Indians, the Sri Lankans, because that's like sub Indian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's still, it's still, it's still. Curry is delicious. Like I love all the Asian food. So what's your what's your least favorite ethnicity? Doesn't have to be Asian. What's your least favorite ethnicity? Colonizers, colonizers. Yeah. Colonizers. Amen. <laughs> colonizers. Amen, sister. I locked down, answer. man. What? So, uh, I'm trying not to get canceled, you feel me? What? You can't get canceled. <laughs> Nobody get canceled no more. As long as you do cancel your own thing. Culture, right? they try to so, it, it, does cancel culture, does that affect your comedy in 2020? Oh, hell no. Okay, good. You I have all types of, uh, no. Cancel culture? It affects yours? Comedy? Um, I just think you just gotta watch what you say. And you should like, you should do whatever but, you want. I told a Holocaust joke in front of the memorial, bro. I'll be you out here like <laughs> I tell a Holocaust joke story of fucking Hanukkah. Like I'm not Tell here. me a Holocaust joke. Oh, you really wanna hear it? This is like good A one material. Uh, nah. Track is like stop. So I'll track's in the back like nah nah. Nah, <laughs> nah, nah. Be, nah, 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 nah. Nah, nah, we're at the show. We're at the show. Yeah, yeah, we're yeah. at the show. <laughs> Show. Show. I don't want to get cancer, so. <laughs> right. Um, no. See, I'm the, what I don't the like truth. about California is they out here counseling people. Like, no, that's not California. That's the whole industry, though. That's from New York Where's to the Cali. Where's industry base? Uh, New York and L.A. That's that part. Okay, so apology accepted. Don't that be part. blaming that on L.A. What's your second least favorite thing in L.A. besides My least favorite thing. Like it's just dry and dusty here. Like your car gets dirty, but it like it used to be like when it rains. Oh, I thought you talking about the niggas. I don't like oh, that I'm they dry and dusty. Yeah. I'm gonna get to that too, because that's the. Do you have a boyfriend? No. Okay. How old are you? Like what I tell people, I am 25 so, plus seven. We talked about. Uh, I will be. My birthday's next month. She's 42, and we just talked about this a couple minutes ago. Do you like <laughs> are women like? I'm is never it, sitting next to this. What'd you say? Why are you mad at me? Why are you mad at me? Junkie, what a junkie though. Yeah. Why say you're 22? Why are you mad at me? Yo, heavy head ass, always talking shit. I'm not talking shit. <laughs> I am not 42. Alright, that's enough, sister. No, I was gonna ask you. Oh, you know I grip the mic. Yeah, it's hard listen. to take it out my Jeez. ass. I will be 25 you're plus. Like, are you getting late? 25 plus 7. 25 plus 7. Hey, fine, we're gonna take ties. Let's go. No, but but is it is it inappropriate in 2020 to ask a woman how old she is? 
No, I'm 25 plus 7. There you go. Or will be on the 12th next month, January 12th. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Thank you. Shout out to Capricorn. You got me doing math and shit. I'm so, like, see, is that because most people are lazy? Like, if you want to know how old I am. I did it. I did it. I did it. So, why don't you just most people are like, too lazy to do 25 I'm, plus 7? I'm, real talk, you'd be surprised. <laughs> you gotta give out, out some better people. How old are you? I'm 25 plus 7. Guess I'll never know. Huh? <laughs> I guess she's 25. Guess I never know. know. <laughs> right. It's like that Tootsie Roll, Tootsie Pop commercial. They were over yeah. that. They're like, yeah, fuck it. Exactly. Well, what's something else that you don't like about LA Last Day? I don't like, oh, and these motherfuckers out here be creating whole lot of personas. Like, Pog attention notifications keep popping off over here. It's, it's crazy. It's like people make like a whole ass fake man. People out here wilding. Like, everybody are like living out there. What's your name? My real, my legal name, like what my mama name? Yeah. My mama name be out there. My name, my legal name is Gloria. And what's your stage name? Doesn't that, isn't that a whole ass persona? It's not a whole ass persona. <laughs> what do you call it? That's what I'm just saying. I hate, I just shake it over on the show. I said, I hate niggas in LA. They make up these personas. And I said, What's your name? You said you were my stage name? Or do you have my. Okay, so that's a persona no, then. Because I have, like, my last name is Polish and German, and it's really fucking hard to spell. What is it? Why? Polnitz. P O E L L. Exactly, nigga. That's why I'm Jones. Carson Jones. There you go. So that's a persona, though, but that is a persona. It's not. No, because, like, all these stories. I understand, but when you have two different names, one name for stage, one name for life, you create a persona. But at the same time, you know how many difficult white last names we gotta learn? Gallup and that kids and all that other shit. You better rock that shit. If they can say they gave a girl, what shit they can finish punching that? For real, I'm tired of that. My last name is Macaulay. It's what? Macaulay. One more time? Macaulay. What name is it? Macaulay. He looks like a nigga that can move a dance, right? That's what she was saying, right? That's what she was saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She was saying. I could see you a little tight. A little tight. What's the kill? So, are you in LA now? That's it. This is your forever home? Yes. That's cool. That's I mean, awesome. I want to have a couple of vacation homes throughout the world. Yeah, man, I feel that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I like that. There's a few vacation homes <laughs> throughout the world. You got to speak that shit into existence. There we are. Hey, I know it's like she fucked with going to Detroit. She lives on Fontana now. She spoke a lot of shit into existence, man. <laughs> That's great. Good for you, sister. Why are you mad at that? That's dope. So That's dope. So That's dope, so man. That's dope, so man. So so man. I used to sleep behind gas stations down the King of the Lake. Don't worry about it. It's all good. I stand in Fontana, though. I stand full of chips. Oh, That's okay, oh sorry about that. My apologies. You know what I'm saying? That's a whole nother hood. A whole nother app. How, how is comedy in 2020 for you? I'd say everybody else. This thing is checked out, so. Oh, you're in the trap, right? <laughs> okay, uh, wait, no, well, I, mean, I like this. This is a lot of, this is a lot of Midwest coming to the West over here. I'm liking this. You know what I'm saying? Detroit, Chicago, Chicago. We had to get up out of there. Just know me and my parents get divorced. I know it for a fact. That's why they moved out here. Mama was like, I'm leaving your daddy for the sunshine. Yeah. Big Bear and shit. Big Bear. Mad Men shit. But it's right. different on a mountain, though. You can, like, play it's on it. It's on the side of a mountain. If I can drive an hour to be out of the snow, it's not real snow. Oh, it ain't real. Mountain yeah. snow compared to yeah. snow that's in the hood, right? Mountain right. Snow. It's all dirty and oily and black. It's white snow in the hood. Yeah. Yeah. I've never been skiing, so I wouldn't know. Oh, skiing is fun now. I've I never been skiing. You ain't been skiing, sister. I've never been skiing. When's the last time you went skiing? Yo, Ty, you ever gone skiing before? I will pay money. Uh, next, I'll set it up. Young Box Rex is going to Big Bill in, in a month. Oh, okay, you What's that? I never seen it. I feel like you have snow bunny somewhere to get snow and shit. Right. What do you mean? Uh, you got to have it in trouble, man. <laughs> no, I got you. You got to have it in trouble. I'm just saying. I know what you got to have And his pride was like, hey, you know what I'm doing, man. He got home. Nah, man, you know what I'm saying? That's my persona, you know what I'm saying? Doing my thing. Um, you don't want to go see well, I'm No, I don't really want to see Think about the coach who wear the fashion. Do it for the boots. Do it for the scarves. I don't know. No, no, I don't really. I feel you. I, 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 I don't want to go on the boots. It is cold. Did you go outside and snow? But you're well, fine. But why would you want to do that? Because it's fun. You in that fist. Then you going down that hill? I have. I did the bunny slopes because I wasn't gonna fall into no fucking tree. You know, I'm trying to think. <laughs> and yeah, I was twelve last time I was skiing. There you go. There you go. I seen somebody fall, and like if you fall hard enough, the skis will pop off the boot. Whoa. Like the save, you can stop you from fucking yourself up. And I kept seeing people that came with me because it was a church trip. I keep seeing these little skis pop off <laughs> everywhere. I just see a skis pop, and I'm like, you know what? You make the pizza thing when you want to slow down and stop. Like you know what? I got a quite enough of this. Oh, 
she had a rule. Pizza? Pizza okay. Pizza by the end. She got Taught me to see all right, you stop. Make the pizza. Yes. When you want to chop fast. Okay. So, so we're gonna go to Big Bill. We're gonna Lego's yeah. gonna record music for his album. <laughs> and I'm, I'm Ty Evans. You on Fight Club Show? I will pay for it. I'll pay for your push for trip if you let me film you ski down the mountain. Just I think that I think that'd be the greatest thing ever. You could be all bundled up in a big ass jacket and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. the bubble jacket. Yes, the bubble jacket. You just want to. You just want to. You want to. He wants to meet some snow buddies. See, I'm not interested in that, but you want to meet some snow buddies, right? Some bargaining is fun. I said you can't get down the sled. I will take a little sled, you know, top of a track. Well, sled's different from skiing. Sleds you sit down on something. Right. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to do that. It's dangerous. Y'all going to do that. Now it's fun. When are you telling me about fun? I have a question, though. Have you ever had a snow bunny in California and L.A.? No. I'm talking about like actual uh, You bunny. honestly, I'm all jokes aside, the cameras are cut off at this point. No. You've never woman. had a white woman in LA? No. Are you interested in having a white woman in LA? Stay black, brother. Stay black. Black love. I mean, black I love. I ain't the pose. You ain't never been with a black oh, woman in LA? Either. That means that's so, what's, right what's your favorite type of woman? Uh, let's make it. living. One, two, three. Black, white, Alive. Mexican, Mexican, black, <laughs> white. What is it? Genetically born oh, that way. There you go. Okay. Well, that's good. It, I, I, if, it was, if I was you, I would say black women, but I guess that's not you. Dang, right. You just want to no so season chicken. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. I see how you begin. You just want season chicken. That's all. Papa just wants season food. You have no preference. Seriously, man. No type at all. Nothing you prefer. You have a preference, though. I got a preference. What's your preference? He was talking about ethnic. What's your preference? They owe you. They pressing you. Apply pressure, y'all. Apply pressure. Okay. Here, I can't take it. Say something difficult. Try to shut it out. Like, oh, I prefer a Hawaiian bitch with a Polynesian yeah. mama. <laughs> What's the most exotic woman you've ever had? Who cares what you type? What's his life? He's like, nigga, he looking at you like, nigga, you already know what I'm doing. I've known you for he six, you seven eyes, years. He's and we talked about like crazy stuff. stuff. And I ask you what you type. I don't ask you how much kids you have. I ask you what your type is. You look at me like I'm actually a coach. I like funny women, man. Such a lot of time. You are such a liar. No, I like funny ah, women. Like, you like, you like. The truth like, there, I know I, I'm not talking about comedy funny. I'm talking about the good sense of humor. You know what I mean? You like funny looking? Like funny looking when I like that. Good sense of humor. Big foreheads. Yeah. Yeah. Funny, yeah. smelling. Yeah. I get it. I respect that. Ty, I love you, man. I appreciate like going in town. He's like an awkward bitch. He just said that right now. He's like an awkward bitch. A little funny, little bitch. With more social skills, so she can't talk little, to no other nigga. Little yeah. nasty. You know, you know, she can't talk to nobody like else. Little, little, little lanky over here, you know what I'm saying? Missing a side tooth, you know what I'm saying? Missing a side tooth. None of that. You ever been with a midget before? What is it with people in LA and fucking midgets? Like, this comes up a lot in like. Is that in LA? You are, you are hanging out with some crazy. It comes up a lot, midgets? Yeah, fucking right midgets. They popping right now. You see those midgets on Instagram? There's, there's, there's a couple that was really popping. Yeah, yeah. Are midgets popping right now? But should midgets not should, should midgets not get love as well? I'm not gonna lie. Those little Atlanta midgets bags are so cute. They're so cute. There's a lot of like. There's like a 2020 lollipop league popping across the country. Black ties, bitch. But when you say it like, why is everyone talking about midgets? I don't People know. Love midgets right now. Right? I'm not gonna lie. I do feel that it is kind of awkward when I see a man that's, you know, like six feet chilling with midgets. Like, what is that? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. 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 Yeah, <laughs> hey, they fuck with number two, nigga. Left, I tried to date a short guy one time, and it was really, no. really fun. We had a good time, but then we started making out, and like I could feel his toe hitting my shin a little bit. Uh. And he wasn't on my level of body. Once we laid down, I didn't like it. You know, like he rolled over and his foot hit my leg. I'm like, no, your foot's supposed to hit my foot at least. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, no short guy. I can't really go all the way there. I've never really liked I can't date short guys. Like, most how, guys. How do you like I the guys in LA? I don't. You don't like oh, guys in LA? No. There's, there's a, but there's so many different types of men in LA. You can't just generalize them like that. Yeah, but men are like generally like full of like I just think uh, it's the men in LA. Shit. Yeah. I'm going to give you a shout out. Because I really talked to you. We had during this whole thing. Yeah, that's awesome, man. Congratulations. Yeah, the world is on pause. Because it's time for you to over here, man. Young Black Productions got five events every single week, man. Yeah. What is it that made you say, hey, I'm going to California? Um, just the things that I want to do with my company. I, I just want to access to better resources. The things that I want to do immediately as far as like writing, like I want to get, you know, I want to get
get a show on that one. Yeah. And I need to have people out here that can write with and read with and actually work with. Like, and where you from? Chicago. Yeah, a lot of niggas in Chicago can't read and write. I got you. No, I worked at hey, CPS yeah. for 10 years and you're not wrong. Hey, <laughs> you are not I'm wrong. Oh, work at CPS and you probably have some good material. Oh, I do. I try not to talk about people kids with a name. I know, but just, me. you know, embellish. Cold. Yeah, young boy, young knees. boy, they come and shovel you out. Oh Lord, Lord not shovel, shovel. shovel her out. Shovel. 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 What is that? Turn like? turning vaginas into walkways. <laughs> she out here shovel out. Shovel it out. That's how you. When, when it's snow, yeah, that sounds a little aggressive. No, no, when you ain't that easy. Yeah, that sounds a little aggressive. You need a nigga to shovel you out. No, no. This is 2020. You better have a snowblower. You know, you plug it into the wall. You know, just go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I, I think it's snow blowing something that you own. I like where this is going. Right? Okay, so what else I need? <laughs> <laughs> you got some salt? <laughs> oh, shit. Make sure you throw some salt down. Okay. Salt. <laughs> Hey, I just want to appreciate you coming to a man. Thank you. I, I got lost you. like three no, no, times to get here. Dude, the streets are super difficult. I understand. No, um, no, no but no signs. For real, not even about IHOP. network, network, network. Because that's how I feel like since I've been out here on the grind or whatever. I was in a movie on Thursday, y'all. I'm really, really excited about What's it. What's the movie? What's coming yeah. out. The movie's called The Gray Area. There you go. Okay. okay. It'll be out the the next year around Ooh. April 1st. What's, What's it about? about? excited yeah. about it. <laughs> it's about this um couple and they come into some money and they're trying to figure out what to do with it. Did they hit a lick the fun? No, I'm one of the people trying to get them to invest some money. And it's really fun, and I got to be myself. And I'm so excited. Even my son got to partake in it with me. And he did a awesome. great job. We both, like, killed it, knocked out the park. It was awesome. And you're humble about it, too, so that's cool. Super awesome. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be side four, man. What? Because I said you're humble about it. It's like, oh, you're humble about it, yeah. Yeah, you're humble. Listen, I'm the most humble man right, on the planet, yeah. dude. Oh, so. I am humble. <laughs> I put it in at the end. Yeah, but yeah, I'm really, really excited about it. So I'm good. happy for you. That's me dope. and my son did some, like, a mother, you know what I mean? Mother son shit. It was really dope. We got to, like, totally be ourselves. You're on your Will and Jada type yeah, shit. Yeah, girl. We're trying to be like Tasha and Malik, you know, on the Ooh, game. And shit. Okay. I see that. Get money. All right, anyway. Get money. Let people know where they can find you on Instagram and all that good stuff. Um, you can find me at Deanna underscore Michelle, D-I-O-N-N-A. Michelle with two L's. Um, and I'm also on Insta- um, I'm on um, Twitter as well, Leggy Bundy. Catch me over there. I'll be over here acting a bull. Um, I also have a blog going on called Tall Topics. I usually get ready in the morning. Sometimes I'll be braiding my Tall hair. Topics? Towel Topics. I sit there with my towel, and I'll be tall on there too because you know I'm long. You're tall. You sit there with your towel and you do your thing. Yeah, I sit there with my towel. You might as well get only fans in because I like to braid my hair. Yes. Would you? Would you? Would you get only? Or do you have an only man? Man, I was trying to start one with my ex, but he went about that life more. But well, yeah. you know you can find that LA. <laughs> yeah, there's a there's a ton of dudes. I found out niggas out here low key doing porn. She know what to tell you. Oh, have you met somebody like that? Would you talk to somebody? We gonna have a drink later. Well, it's on, it doesn't count if it's on camera. Have, were you going out with a guy and he found out? Going out too strong. Okay, well, how would you I don't know, man. I don't man, it's just find out people like who they say they are and they do what they The different they personas, know. right? Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, no, I'm asking. I don't know for anything. today is persona. I don't know anything. I'm just some, uh, you know, some dude. Nah, I just noticed you better pay attention. You drop your books, you lose your life. Ooh. I like you, man. I like talk. you. Listen to what people talk because they tell on themselves. You know what? I heard and I'm like, you know what? I'm going to head out. So what did he say? His real, well, his fake name. Then I found a nigga real name. What's his, what's his fake name? I can't do that. Why you not? Mm. Could you okay. fuck a porn star? I don't know if I fuck a porn star. No. On purpose. Right? On purpose. No, that's yeah, close, knowingly. right? That's close, dude. They feel like doing like twenty thousand people. It's disgusting, man. Right? But what if they've only done a few like effective films? If they're new. A newer porn star, right? They're not so that means they suck. Like, like, not like a Mia Khalifa, like more like a. Get out. I don't know. Would you go out with a man that does that? Whoa! I'd maybe go out the camera guy. No, but the camera guy's in the worst position. Yeah, he's in the splash zone. How, 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 how you think they get those shots? But so he's not fucking. His shirt has like balls and ass. He's okay. disgusting. The cameraman's disgusting. Yeah, he's disgusting. He's in the splash zone, bro. That's disgusting. That's disgusting. He's in the splash zone at all times. Yeah, fuck the cameraman. Okay. No, you tell me. I'm asking you. 
Um, if I'm gonna fuck anybody on set of porn, <laughs> yes. it's not gonna be the porn star. It'll Don't be kiss the, the fuck the man, the caterer. The caterer. <laughs> Maybe the caterer. The guy getting coffee and shit. Yeah. The man delivering the, the meat. That's yeah. what you want. How many porn stars you know? How about you speak in the mic? You know what you does? Uh, he know yeah. a lot of porn stars. I know a lot gentlemen. of. How do you mean? How do you mean a lot of porn stars? A lot of them kind of my bitch. Do you know them like your 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 casting couch? No, I didn't. I didn't even know they was. Cause they really look more. You know they just hit me with all the They actually. Look. Hey man, would you would you look up a porn star? Huh? If you high, you can hear. Would you look up with a porn star? Yeah, we friends. No friends. comment. So, but you would hook hey, up man. with no connections, would you say? Yeah. He's yeah, fast. I mean, he's yeah, basically yeah. saying he would Nail wear a rubber and a hat. But he'd give it to him. That's why I said, would you fuck a porn star? Yeah. As long as you wear your rubber and a hat. Nail and bail, bro. Nail and bail. What did you think I meant? What did you think I meant? What did you think I meant? You think I would ask you, would you be a porn Would you be friends with a porn star? That's no problem. That's no problem. That's no problem. <laughs> fuck with, fuck with me. There you go. All right, Ty. Great, 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 great job today, man. You didn't talk in the microphone. You want to answer any questions. <laughs> You're on your phone 75% of the time. You're done for at least the rest of Woo! how long? Six months. Six months. You're out of here, Ty. No B-side phone for six months, man. You don't respect the platform. Great fucking job. B-side. See you next week. <laughs> <laughs> um, anything else you want to promote? Uh. You can say you're OnlyFans. Someone's I gonna mean, judge you. Yeah. Get that money, sister. No, I mean, I, 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 I look, I haven't went stuff. there yet. But you say like it's a bad thing. There's nothing wrong with it. It's not a bad thing, like, but if you, you do know. catch me with my nipples out, like bacon pancakes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm sure. Hey, I'm sure there's a market for that, right? Uh, yeah, fuck. That dude's like, oh, this is great. You can oh, make yeah, a lot of money off of feet stuff. I, I, yes, I I'm stuff. not even a lot of times. I can make a girl Those size 14 feet right there, sister, you make a kill it, dude. They can be 14, but don't tell me that's towing delectable. Not to me. Thank you. <laughs> I'm not interested. In hey, that. I dated a guy who only liked to have sex with my feet. You want to look at my feet? We'll put my feet in the fucking hey, camera. Look at my uh, They're uh, edible. Tones, like, We're not king do, do you like when people? Do you like when people uh, suck your toes? Um, I have had my toes like before, and I actually had an orgasm full on. It's an amazing yeah, feeling. It really is. It's an amazing. Hey, I didn't even have to ask her. She said that shit. Amazing. <laughs> you got to tell you, young. You do toes? <laughs> if you ain't never had toes. You do toes? No, no, no. no. Okay. Full I've only kissed a woman before, so I don't go that I won't far. even go that far. Anything else you want to promote? Um, yeah, I guess y'all. You suck toes? Sucking toes. No. Okay. What's, what do you do? What's the nastiest thing you do? Um, probably get naked. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I like. I won't eat booty. That's. I, I know that. I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> what you want to do to make What do you do to make it nasty? Oh, you know, What's nasty? Oh, no, oh, no, 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 crazy, folks. I just, I just can't. I can't. I can't do it. So what I mean, do you, you, you say? Yo, what do you do that's nasty? You see, guys, I just think you're not yet. You make it go no shit. I personally, I don't touch that. I personally know it feels good for women. Women, a plenty of women told and me this. And knowing that like, you still won't do it, that's selfish. selfish if you don't no, do it. Yeah, yeah, but it's selfish. Yeah, 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 yeah,
Yeah. How you know a nigga lying when you use random vocabulary words? Oh, come on. I'm This is quizzically. Oh, yeah. He was about it. He was about it once or twice. He like. Nah, nah. I can't. What do you like with a guy that's. What is it? Let me ask you who's better. No hesitation. That's the truth. I respect it. I'll leave it on that, man. Ty Evans. You got anything else you got to say? Let them know where they can find you and understand all that good stuff. L-T-I-L-T-Y-C-O-L-E-D-Y. And then every Saturday night, Inglewood, man, Texas for the address, 310-345-2909, man. We got great comedy, great comedy. We have great comedians, we have live hip-hop, and we have tacos, plus a full bar. We have a 420 Fendo coming through. And, uh, nigga, let's bet. You gonna call me out on, on my show. You gonna call me out on my show in front of my people. I'm gonna be upset. Well, so there's tacos. Tacos like the hard shell and the lettuce and shell, like no, real cilantro not, not, and fucking onions and that's shit. That's not where I'm from. That's not tacos I Okay, so real street tacos. Yeah, real street tacos. Real street nigga, real street tacos. Alright, that's the yeah. yeah. I like real shit. Wait, y'all use the corn or the flour tortillas? It's always corn in the street yeah, tacos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, you know. Hey, Fabio, Unless it's Salvadorian person, then they got the fucking you know what I'm saying? Oh, I just want to make sure he could, man. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> never not clapping. He's never not clapping. I know. Clapping. Oh, oh, it's just a setup. No, something's going to be a little strange. That's all. Um, I got to stop. Somebody's going to stop making What is your nationality? I'm half black and half Mexican. Okay. Yeah. Act like you ain't been to my DMs. Like, you need a lot before. of work, I mean, man. I forgot. She act like she ain't been to my DMs. Everybody, I'm doing a show, nigga. I you should watch it. It's a great show. You come back. You're Samoan shit, low key. Everybody thinks I'm Samoan, man. Everybody yeah, so don't cut me out about it. Yeah, but you've been in my DMs asking me, oh, what's your nationality? And now you're going to come on this camera and be like, oh. Why are you telling me in his DMs? Like, I got here off a DM. Nigga, I'm here now off a DM. All right, let's keep it down. I'm just sipping this tea slowly. Yeah, what would you like? Um, what would you like? Where can people find you on Instagram and all that good stuff? Oh, uh, you can find me minding my business at CJZ underscore comedy, uh, CJZ underscore comedy on Twitter. Uh, also, you can find me on Instagram, Facebook, Carmelita Jones. Also, CJZ comedy. It's a hashtag too. So if you type that in, it'll pop up on any platform because I'm out here. Hashtag branding. And you're going to be performing this weekend, right? Yeah. Saturday, Saturday and Sunday? Or Saturday? Both of them. Yeah, I like that. I like that. Hey, I want to apologize because Lego and Ty Evans were talking during the set. And I didn't put it in the chat. So I apologize. Okay. That's the people still laugh, though. Hey, yeah. People loved it. People loved it. Because I'm funny. What's I up? Kind of everything. No, I think, I think it's super funny, man. My guy. What you got to smoke? Close to that, uh, nigga. I think I'm going to smoke. Uh, you can find me on everything. Tony Mac. T-O-N-E-M-A-C. Tony Mac. Tony Mac. Tony Mac. Tony Mac. Uh, I'm hosting on Sunday, so you guys come through. Uh, 310 345 2909. Texas for the address is in the 818. Full bar, it's at a bar. Names just be doing the rest of the week. We got Trap Boys headlining. That's going to be dope. Uh, and then that's it. I think that's it. Have fun. Have a good night. Well, we'll, so polite. What do you like when a guy does me? Respect me. There you go, man. Young Bach Productions, Eastside Forum, <laughs> Thursday night, Syrian News Inc. Man, live show only on IGTV at Young Bach Productions. I just thought about it, Daddy. You look like Camino a little bit. Don't do that. Don't do that. Why is that a diss? Camino's a millionaire. Multi millionaire. Catch, there you us, go. catch us right and dirty on Saturday with the homie Camino. Oh, and you're doing it this weekend too, right? I am doing it this weekend. You say it with all these cameras, all these people. Doing it, doing it, doing it. Well, I'm going to be driving <laughs> legally. Oh, hey, you know what? <laughs> big big Taco's going to be there, too, so you got to make sure you come Okay, through. that's what. He bringing us El Salvador and Taco? Damn, you can't call him something. He's Mexican like me. You, can't you just that. said El Salvador. No, I said El Salvador. I want real Taco. Taco. Oh. Thursday like night, Serial News Inc. Man, live from Echo Park, only on IG, at Young Bach Productions. Say something, Ty, get off your phone real 9 quick. 9 p.m., man. We gotta talk to the holes in a different area code. Saturday night, Inglewood oh, Comedy, yeah, Hip Hop, and Tacos, man. Hit us up for the IG, for the address, 310 345 2909. I just wanna say one thing. Friday night, we're giving away $2,000 cash money, the best performer. And that's all it's gonna be in Inglewood, man. Hit us up, 310 345 2909. And then we're gonna oh, jump no, back no, Sunday. No, no, no. Ooh, ooh. Sunday, get money, get money, Sunday get morning, get the money, Sunday money, sunset. We're at Venice Beach. I'll be on every single Sunday, man. Young Park Productions, Dogtown Pop Up, live performances on the world's most famous beach, Venice Beach Boardwalk. And then Sunday night in uh, Reseda, secret location, comedy, hip hop. Ty Evans, Tony's gonna be there, Young Box gonna be there, uh, Lakers gonna be there, Young Baca. That's out of the way, man. man. Young Baca! Make sure you come to any of these fences this weekend. Make sure you bring a toy for the beautiful children, 818, man. Young Baca Productions. And a mask.
Anything else you guys say? You can find me at What's Up Ash and on Instagram, and you can find me spinning the Dogtown pop up every Sunday. It was dope last week with Fallon, right? It was right? dope. It was last really week. That was one of like the highlights of yeah. probably like my, D- my DJ career this yeah. pandemic. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we got people yeah, come on, man, come DJ, on, come that's on. what I'm talking about. Show your mic with this guy right here. Show your mic with this guy right here. I just want to say real quick before we leave, um, you know, since it's the, it's the holiday season and we're giving and everything, come back, get back to the community in Whittier, in the city of Whittier, at the W, right there. It's right there. It's at the Winning, okay? It's right there on Hadley and Whittier Boulevard. Okay, right off the 605. You come on 605 Whittier Boulevard, it's right there on Hadley. Come through for your toy, you know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Show some love, you know what I mean? Get back, you feel me? That's, That's right. What about, man. What's your Instagram? Really quick? What's your Instagram? What's that? Big Bible five six two. Come check me out. And you on the new Lake Economics, right? That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, man. Yes, sir. Young Bob Productions. Let's get it, baby. We out. Yeah. Let's get it. Cool.